Hello guys, this is Doran's Movies, and this is actually going to be a bit of a lore slash a bit story video, I guess. And today I would like to show you a quick little, you know, a bit of a hidden story. It's not really too well hidden, I mean, it's kind of in the middle of the field, but it's a bit of a hidden story, and it's not really part of the main story in the Frostfire Ridge. So, while I was doing some quests in the Frostfire Ridge in the Wallets of Denner Alpha, uh, I was gathering, I, I believe, some some supplies for the garrison. I was actually, I believe, like the the troll that was with me called me like to get some venom and some ice shards or something to get traps, you know, for hunting. And pretty much while I was questing, I found this little, well, <laughs> not really little, but this orc corpse. And it's actually, it, it's a corpse of a young orc traveler. And it actually held a scroll when I clicked on it, so I took the scroll. And pretty much what happened then is I could actually, you know, click the scroll and there was like this snow hair's foot and a four lined scroll in there. So actually the, the foot, I believe it's like a talisman and there's two of them and the scroll actually says here, or it, one second, here it is. It says, Karish, my wolf, I was so happy to find your note. I had to bite my knuckle to keep you from yelling and walking up on other trappers. Of course, I remember that day, you and Long Howl prowling the flats, looking so fierce, my unsteady aim that pitiful throw, can you believe you almost killed each other, now I want nothing more than to live beside you for all my days, I know a place north across the flats behind the volcano overlooking Grand Bolash. I will leave bones to mark the way, come find me and we can be free together, yours forever Magra. P.S. I will keep Long Howl's fang safe. Attached is my own good luck charm and foot from my first successful snare. Bring it safely to me or I will gut you like a hair. So obviously as you can tell this is kind of like a weird love couple. Like these two orcs that probably escaped from different clans. I'm not really certain. But looks like he was going to meet her and I believe the corpse said that he was killed by wolves. Or I don't know what, what he was killed by. But... Pretty much, he, I believe he was near there, so after after that, she said that she left these bones for, so he can find her. So I tried to follow these bones and it took me like, for, for some reason, it took me like 15 minutes. And I don't know, this is one of those, you know, those, as I mentioned previously in a few videos back, it's that they added these kind of RPG aspects into the game, so it's not, it's not really like a quest, I mean this story it's, it's more like uh, you know one of those rpgs where you have to find your own clues so it's not like you click it accept and then you follow there and you, you know you just you just follow the minimap and you're there you pretty much have to read that and you know north from grand Palash, i believe that's the volcano so i was looking there i got a bit lost because i don't know the road is a bit weird here but i somehow actually managed to to get back and where it was is you know as you can see on the map, there is like these crackling plains, and I just went north, and just a bit above, there was like this, um, like this little hut, and pretty much what I found here was a young orc woman. It's not really a hunt, it's, it's more like a tent, and as you can see in the video, it's like this young orc woman, and it says, This orc appears to have been camping here for several days before succumbing to the bitter cold. Her face is frozen in a woeful stare, gazing southwest toward the icy flats. Clutch to her breast is a nearly folded letter. So as you can tell, she was waiting for him, and looks like she just froze to death. Or maybe she couldn't, I don't know why she couldn't start up a fire. Maybe it's because of the beasts around, maybe the fire couldn't start because of the wind, I'm not certain. So as you can see, I took her letter, and there is a Frostwolf first fang, and I believe that's the talisman from the other orc, from the male orc. And also there was another note there as well. And what it said is, Magra, my huntress, another dull day at the Stonefang outpost. As I stare across the flats, I cannot help but think of you. Do you remember the day we met? I hurled my axe at your mount and you nearly impaled me with a spear. It was love at first sight. Clans be damned, my mind is made up. I will leave it to be with you. Choose the place, I will come. We'll leave Frostfire and make life somewhere. I hear Nagrand is beautiful. Your future mate, Karash. I have enclosed Long Howl's first fang. I was wearing it around my neck that day. I hope it will guide you to me once again. So, as you can see, the story is, you know, kind of the same they're mentioning. They're pretty much just mentioning the story when they first met. And, yeah, this is actually a really cool, you know, bit of a hidden story. So that you can find them. And apparently you can use these two talismans and bind them together. 
But so far it's the alpha, so nothing really happens. But I guess you could create something, I don't think they fully implemented that yet, but they could, you know, make something cool out of it. Not really, not even a piece of gear, but maybe, you know, I don't know, something story related or maybe another clue or something else. But I guess, you know, th this this story is, you know, kind of a bit sad. They pretty much, they were so close, like 100, 200 meters apart, and she froze to death here and he was killed by the wolves. So their plan didn't turn out, you know, <laughs> didn't really turn out in the end. But yeah, that's pretty much it. I just wanted to show you guys, you know, a bit of a hidden story in the game. I don't really wanna... Well, I, I could actually cover, you know, some main stories in the future. But as you might be able to tell, I, I actually just got Alpha Access. Maybe a day or two before they closed off the zone. So I didn't manage to finish the entire main questline. So I'm not fully, you know fully on with the story but i actually do, do know a bit about the story you know some parts of it but i didn't actually finish it so i don't know what happens in the end but i should be in the shadow moon valley alpha zone testing so i could be able to tell you know the story there but yeah just just leave me some feedback if you'd like to see more of these as i probably will cover a few more of these you know these kind of hidden stories that are not really a part of the main stories, but are actually interesting. And you know, these kind of RPG aspects of the MMORPG game World of Warcraft. It's it's kind of new. They they only, I believe they tested that out on the Timeless Isle. But they actually just, you know, kind of made it, you know, more serious in World of Draenor. Plus it's the alpha, so it's not fully finished. But yeah, as I said, just give me some feedback if you'd like to see more of these stories. As I'm guessing there is a few others there as well. Alright, that is all here for now. Thanks for watching, and don't forget to like, favorite, and subscribe. See you next time.